We need to take urgent action to stop climate change. We are faced with an opportunity for humanity to correct past mistakes and significantly improve our quality of life. The great news is that we have the money we need to make the necessary changes to reduce our emissions. One of the sources of funds is the European Emissions Trading System, the ETS. But what is the ETS? The ETS is a tool used by the European Union to reduce greenhouse gases. It is based on the carrot and stick approach. Those who pollute must pay a lot of money for their pollution, more and more every year. At the same time, the production of goods, energy and transport based on clean energy is becoming cheaper. Thanks to the ETS, member states received their share of over 29.7 billion euro in revenue in 2022 alone. That's enough to provide solar panels for up to 5.4 million homes. All ETS funds should be used for climate purposes. So far, the ETS has only covered sectors responsible for less than half of our CO2 emissions, such as energy, industry and aviation. Now it will include emissions from the maritime industry, and at a later stage from buildings and road transport. This will be the ETS too. But that's not all. It will also cover emissions of other gases, methane and nitrous oxide, which are poisonous to humans and harmful to the climate. Thanks to this change, the system will be more effective. Together with the expansion of the ETS, a social climate fund will be created. It will start operating in 2026 and will be financed mainly by fees for emissions from the sectors covered by the ETS2. The Social Climate Fund will provide up to 87 billion euro for investments across the European Union from 2026 to 2032. The fund will support citizens and small entrepreneurs. This money will be used for home insulation, heat pumps, solar panels and electric mobility, empowering our transition to clean and safe energy.